kimchi soup. It's one of the Korean famous dishes. Now you need rice to eat that shit, so let's cook rice first. We're only gonna eat for one person's worth, so just wanna do one cup. Now I've cooked a lot, so I don't I don't really need to measure. I can just do it by just with my eyes. Now you wanna wash the rice to make sure there's no like bad stuff for 10 seconds. It should be rice one, water 1.5 for that juicy, delicious, fluffy water, uh, rice, white rice. Yeah, we're gonna make the rice. Now, while we're waiting for the rice to cook, we're going to make a uh, kimchi soup. So first, we need uh a pan all right this will do and put some water in boil the water there's like different types of kimchi jjigae like there's a uh, pork there's tuna today we're gonna be eating the pork we're gonna be using a clean cut back leg pork all the way imported all the way from norway where they have the best pigs. This cost a fortune. $4,840 for this uh, piece of meat. Let's take out the other ingredients while we're waiting. Yep, you have to always wash dishes while you're waiting, when you're cooking, in order to save time. Time is gold. Now, when you're making kimchi jjigae, you need like uh, different kinds of spices, like red pepper flakes, and salt, and sugar, and soy sauce. But we don't have any of those, so we're going to improvise. Now what this does is it's going to boil the pork. And it's going to get the, all the oil out of the pork. And it's going to stew it. Very nice. Now some people in the chat is asking, why aren't you washing the meat first? If you wash the meat, then it erases the pork flavor, which is what we're going for here. So... It, it won't taste like a pork kimchi jjigae. Now you see this white stuff, the meat, the oil? Make sure you don't throw it out like this. This is going to bring the flavor of the kimchi stew. So now since we don't have the kimchi, the gochugaru, the, the spice, we're going to be using the, the water left from the kimchi. That's going to give us the spicy flavor. Okay? And the meat is going to... If the oil is going to give us the rich flavor. Do you have instant noodles? Yes, I do. I try to not eat them because I have a stomach ache after. Well, right, there they are. How much the standard cost of living in Korea? You can Google that. I think it's like 2K, 3K? Right now, I, I'm spending 3K per month. 2.5. Is it cheaper to cook versus buying outside in Korea? I mean, if you know how to cook, it's like cheaper to cook. Wait one minute and let's put in the spice of the kimchi. Let's get the tofu ready. Now I like it big and thick, so let's just uh, make it big and thick, okay? Just four pieces. I think it's ready to put in the kimchi. Put in the kimchi. That's going to bring out the spicy flavor. All right, nice. Now pork, you can't eat it raw, so you have to make sure it's uh it's cooked. Now, if you are luxury, if you are living in like a Luxury, you can add in some like salt. You can add in salt, sugar, and uh, soy sauce, okay? It's supposed to boil. How come like the water is not boiling? Hmm, right? I'm supposed to add in like the tofu and the leek, but I feel like it's gonna overflow. 
Oh, the rice. Look at the rice. It's beautiful. I do not have a bigger pot. I don't think I, you can cook it in this, right? You can cook like soup stuff in this? Are you sure? I feel like we should uh... Nah, fuck it, it's too late Okay, it's boiling Alright, now Oh my god, thank god it's upside down, okay Now time to put in the tofu Oh fuck, I feel like it's gonna overflow Fuck! Oh yo 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 Stop it, stop, stop, stop Stop, stop it, stop! Mmm, smells delicious! Holy shit! The longer you boil it, the more flavor there is. Now, we're, now you have to put in the things that smoosh at the very last. So let's put this in very last when the rice is ready. Oh, it actually looks not bad. It smells pretty good too. We're gonna wait until this is yellow and then we're gonna put in the tofu and then we're gonna add in the leek. The clothes are not lying around. The clothes are all where they should, where they where they should be. Oh wait, I think the rice is ready. Yup, rice is ready. Good. Beautiful. Looks really good. Let's add in the tofu now. Adding in the tofu. Maybe we should cut this in half. Maybe it's too thick. Adding the tofus. Cut the other in half. In half. Okay, perfect. Now we cut the leek. Oh, the leek is brown! Leek is brown! Is it safe to eat? But it's brown! Alright, looks beautiful. Look at this. Wow. I work with what I don't, what I like have. Usually like there's supposed to be a lot more ingredients. But you know, cooking is all about instincts. And raw feeling. The gut feeling. But now we're done. Ah. Oh. Look at this, beautiful. Homemade kimchi jjigae. And rice. Homemade rice. Whew. Whew. Look at this. It does look bland as fuck. I, I, uh, I can't do much about it. I don't have any spice. And it's like a waste of money to buy like all the spice because I'm only going to use it once. It looks not bad. Mmm. To be honest, when I tasted the water, the soup, it tasted really bland. But the pork tastes like pork and the tofu tastes like tofu and the kimchi tastes like kimchi. So it's like worth eating. I, I think I can finish this. Success. A huge success. Hi, Sister Six. Do I have practice today? Yes, I have practice in two hours. Rate the food out of 10. Five being average. Six tastes good. Uh, below five, it doesn't taste good. Two. I rated two. This is the worst kimchi chicken I've ever tasted. You know why? It's their food. There's pork, there's meat, there's kimchi, there's tofu. And I told you it, it all tastes like what, it, what they two taste should. What the what they should taste like. As long as I don't get sick, it's all good. I never see you get sick on stream. It's because I don't I drink a lot of water. That's the secret. So I have I have five meals and I like rotate. First is cereal, second is fried eggs and rice. Third is tuna and kimchi. 
Fourth is、uh, ramen. Fifth is salad. So I have five meals that I rotate, like every like. Yeah, so I don't need seasoning. Don't need salt, sugar, soy sauce. All my Instagram posts are just food. Ah,、uh, I just want to share, like, some cool stuff, and like those are the cool stuff that I run into.